Uh, I'm looking up at this most beautiful pine trees and the amazing sunset, which is obscured by a silhouette of a man's hand clutching a knife. And I watch him stab me in the chest. That missed my heart by four millimeters. They think I'm dead. They leave. I realize I'm going to be dead within minutes and I have one last goal <coughs> and that is to <coughs> get as far as I can nearer to where I parked the car so the police can find my body. I managed to stand. I mean I can't, I can't look at Christine. I mean if I look at her I can't speak with her, I can't hold her because I'm gagged and bound. <coughs> so I turn my back and step by step Gag bound barefoot, I, I, I begin to walk through the forest uphill and I'm thinking of all kinds of, you know, the people I love. I'm thinking what I'm going to miss out on in life. And by doing these things, I managed to walk over a mile and I had six snap ribs, 30 broken bones, bones that had splintered off into my lungs and diaphragm, 13 machete wounds, a dislocated shoulder, a crushed sternum, a broken shoulder blade. Christine's body was found the next day. I'm hospitalized as a press blackout. And six weeks later, the Israeli police, they announced they catch the terrorists. And because I stabbed the guy, the DNA on my knife helped them capture them very quickly. It solved another murder of an Israeli Jewish lady previously. And uh, I was in court with them nine months later. And when the judge asked, but, but why did you murder an American Christian? Christine Lucan was an American Christian. She wasn't Jewish. You know what, Sheila? I, never, I won't forget this. The indifference, the banality. They shrugged, they giggled, and they said, oh, we thought she was Jewish. That's my story. That's an excerpt from my weekly full-length show, The Gun Show. On my show, I take on the issues of the day through my Alberta conservative lens, and I talk to the real newsmakers the mainstream media ignores. To get access to my show and all of our other premium content, click the link on the screen to subscribe today.